It's a beautiful day in April. I'm in Caithness and today I'm going to be taking a flight from Wick John O'Groats Airport to Aberdeen with Eastern Airways. So let's go. Much like the UK's entry at Eurovision, my day started off with hope, promise and anticipation. So scheduled flights from Wick ceased in 2020 when Logan Air and Eastern Airways withdrew services to Edinburgh and Aberdeen respectively. It's 2022, a public service obligation has been put in place and Eastern Airways are back. So our map shows the route that we'll be taking today, fairly direct over the Moray Firth. Eastern Airways offer three ticketing options, value, standard and flexible. I'm on a value ticket at £39.99 for this one-way flight and that gives me 15 kilograms of hold luggage. And so far everything is going swimmingly. Upon entrance to the airport you'll notice that the check-in desks are just to your right upon entry. So after a quick check-in process it's time just to have a little look around. There's a pleasant enough little cafeteria area where there's a couple of vending machines selling hot drinks and snacks and I treated myself to a cup of coffee at a cost of £1.50. Also got a handwritten boarding pass. I don't know when the last time was you got one of those. The waiting area is very pleasant. Um, you're not going to be spending too much time, I don't think. And I would say that every member of ground crew and staff at Wick John O'Groats couldn't have been nicer. I honestly think Wick John O'Groats is the friendliest airport in the UK. Our aircraft today is this BAE Jetstream 41, which is capable of carrying 29 passengers in a 2-1 configuration. And before long it's time for myself and 11 other travellers to make our way to our aircraft. And it's from here that things started to go downhill. Just in case you didn't catch that, I'll play it again. So what can I say about my Eastern Airways experience? Well, before I get on to that, I just want to mention once again that everyone at Wick John O'Groats Airport, all the, the staff and crew were absolutely amazing. They were really friendly and cheery. That's a big thumbs up for them. And uh, it's really lovely to use these regional airports. On to Eastern Airways. So uh, from the flight deck, great. They welcomed us on board our long haul flight from Wick to Aberdeen. So that was great. And that's about as much as I can say for Eastern Airways. Um, the atmosphere was not good. Um, it was unfriendly. I have never before felt unwelcome on a flight. I felt really not wanted. Now, this is not about me banging on about my rights to make a film because it's just a silly YouTube video. I've flown with Eastern Airways several times and I've never had this request to switch off my camera. Now if there's been a change in policy that's absolutely fine. Safety has to come first. I, I totally get that. It's not about me banging on about what I want to do. What I'm saying is you can do that but still make the customer feel valued and important and I felt totally unvalued. They couldn't care less. Um, if that's what Eastern Airways are going for then they're hitting the nail on the head. I won't be flying with them again. Now that doesn't matter because on this particular route they're getting a nice subsidy anyway so it doesn't matter whether I fly with them or not. What I am saying is I live in the Highlands, most of my family live in Caithness and I would rather take the seven hour train journey from Wick to Aberdeen because it's cheaper and I'll be treated like a human being. Um, so Eastern Airways, I, I, I never try to make negative videos or be horrible but I can only go with what I've experienced and my experience with Eastern Airways on this flight was terrible um, so maybe a little bit of work to do Eastern on customer care and making the passenger actually feel valued and important. So much like the UK at Eurovision my day ended with disappointment and despair. This was not the video that I wanted to make but that's the video that I've got. You can rest assured there will be more silly videos being churned out because this is something I actually enjoy doing. Thank you so much for watching and for listening to this rant. Um, please consider giving the video a wee like, comment, subscribe. Have you had similar experiences with Eastern Airways? I'd really be interested to know. Thank you for watching and we'll see you again soon on Tim's Travels.